the Echo Slam. Oh, there it is. Forward. There's your slam. There's the dunk. Hello, Gamer Nom is back. So for today's video, guys, finally, we're going to help this new recheck and see using the Puffy. Okay, so I know everyone was requesting for it. Now is the time to level up this fruit, and we're gonna start by eating it. Okay, so before I continue, guys, you can show your support by using Star Code Gamer Gnome when purchasing your Robux. And for those who requested the Rumble Fruit, don't worry, guys, Rumble Fruit is next. Okay, so let's start by defeating bandits. So every time I start a new fruit, I always Hope that the first skill of the fruit is not a single target fruit. And yes, it is not a single target fruit. I am so thankful for that because leveling will be a lot easier. So again, lure them and then defeat them using your first skill, the heavy paw. The goal here is to reach level 10. Okay, level 10. And after that, we are ready to go to our next island, which is the jungle. We're gonna use a boat. We're not a fishman now. So here we're gonna start with the monkeys, right? You need to defeat six. Lure three at a time. There you go. And defeat them with your heavy paw. After finishing just one quest with this, you're gonna reach level 14. One more quest and you will reach level 17. And now you can start the gorilla quest. So you need to defeat eight. Just lure four. One, two, three, and four. And that's it. Defeat them using your heavy paw. Go. You need to defeat 8, right? So you need to work twice. There you go. So when you reach level 20, you can start defeating the Gorilla King. The mini boss in this jungle. It's easy to defeat. Again, maintain your distance. There you go. And keep on using your Z skill. Heavy paw. So the goal here is to reach level 30. So go back to the Gorillas. If you have a chance, defeat the Gorilla King. Okay. And when you reach level 30, you can now move on to your next island, which is... The pirate village we're gonna start here with the pirates you need to defeat eight to finish one quest you can lure four at a time so you're gonna do this two sets okay two sets of four pirates to finish one quest the goal here is to reach level 40 and after that you can now start the brute quest so guys you need to defeat 10 with the brutes so you can lure five at a time here one two three four and five okay you can defeat them using your heavy, heavy paw there you go okay when you reach level 55 you can start defeating the mini boss in this island and that mini boss is the clown bobby there you go so level up here will be faster when you reach level 55 so how can you defeat him use your z skill dodge to the side there you go the goal is to dodge this one guys there you go or if you want, you can jump over him. This is kind of harder, to be honest. And just don't do it, okay? <laughs> just flexing it. Okay, so guys, just use your heavy paw. There you go. The goal here, again, is to reach level 60. Go back to the brute. There you go. So, stat check, 40. Melee defense. And blast fruit is 100. Next island is the desert. So here, you're gonna start with the desert bandits you need to defeat eight same with the pirate so do the same thing lure four if you want go on top of this house there you go use your z skill okay your goal here is to reach level 75 and it's fine if you exceed it okay okay but 75 is the requirement for your next mob and that mob is the desert officers so here they are you're just gonna lure three if you want four for more experience because you're just gonna wait for them to spawn right and while leveling up, we've already unlocked the second skill, the self-repel. So it's like a mini blink or Soru, that's it. Anyway, guys, the goal here is to reach level 105. Okay, 105. Why Gamer Nom? That's kind of far. I'm going to show you why. Again, 105. We are going to our next island. And it's self-repel. And that island is the Frozen Village. Guys, don't forget to buy the Geppo, the Buso, and the Soru here. The Ability Teacher. Here we go guys, 105 Y. I want to start here with the Yeti. So same with the Gorilla King, is easy to defeat. Number one enemy when fighting mini bosses is you guys. You need to be patient, okay? Okay, so after this, you need to go back to the Snow Bandits. You need to defeat seven, right? You can lure five at a time. I suggest you lure five for more experience. There you go, defeat them using your heavy paw. 
after defeating five, you're gonna need to defeat two more to finish one quest. Every time you have a chance, defeat the Yeti, and the goal here is to reach level 130. Before we proceed to our next island, stat check 95 mil defense all in the blocks room, okay? So now time to proceed to our next island, the Marine Fortress. So here we're just gonna defeat one mob, the Vice Admiral, but game on a Moai! I decided to skip the petty officers, but wait, let's defeat this first. There you go, Z skill. Okay, just dodge to the side. Same old technique, there you go. And guys, we're gonna skip the petty officers, so what are we gonna do? Just server hop, okay? Until Keep on defeating this mini boss, server hop, and that's it. Okay, just do server hop again. The goal here is to reach level 150, and after that, we can now proceed to the Skylands. Guys, check this out. I love this boat. The color, right? Anyway, guys, in the Skylands, we're gonna start with the Sky Bandits. So they are located here, and you just need to defeat seven. So lure four at the time. Okay, you're gonna defeat eight. Yeah, extra experience. There you go. Lure them. Attack. Z skill. There you go. Goal here is to reach level 175. But before we even reach that, we're gonna unlock the Po Barrage X skill 100 mastery. Here it is. There you go. Okay, so more damaging skills, meaning you can level up faster. Okay, the goal again is to reach level 175. And when we reach that, we can now start defeating the Dark Master. So, Dark Master is located here. There you go. In that place. You need to wear 4 because there's only 4 here. Defeat them. You need to defeat 8 to finish 1 quest. The goal here is to reach level 225. So now we have two skills, the Heavy Po and the Po Barrage. So again, 225. Okay, so when you reach that level, stat check. 170 melee, 164 defense, all in the Blocks Fruit, 338. Well now guys, next up, the Coliseum. So here in the Coliseum, we're gonna start with the Toga Warriors. You need to defeat 7, so just lure 4 twice, okay? Here you go, one, two, three, and four. Okay, defeat them. And after that, you're gonna need to lure three more to finish one quest. The goal is to reach level 275. And after that, you can start defeating the gladiators. So here we go, gladiators. You're just gonna lure four. There you go. And defeat it. Before I forgot, guys, you can start leveling up in the prison. Remember, prison at 250. Okay, I forgot to show you 250. Here you can defeat three enemies, Warden, Chief Warden, the Swan. So why 250? So you can defeat all of them, right? Again, the Swan, the Chief Warden, and the Warden. You can level up here. But still, you're gonna finish leveling up with the Gladiators. So guys, again, the goal here is to reach level 300. And after that, we can now go to the Magma Village. We're gonna start here with... The military soldiers, so you're gonna lure two, defeat them, and then lure three on the other side while the previous two spawns, right? And after that, level up. Goal here is 330, but before that, we're gonna unlock our fourth skill, the Paw Nuke. So I'm gonna show it to you. This is the Paw Nuke, it really looks cool. There you go. Anyway, guys, the goal here is to reach level 330, right? After that, you can now level up with the military spy. So just lure four at a time. Because there are only four here. You need to defeat eight to level up, okay? Okay, so when you reach level 350, you can start defeating the mini boss here, the Magma Admiral. You go to level up faster. But the goal here is to reach level 375. Just dodge this skill, guys. There you go. Everything will be easy. Okay, so again. Upon reaching level 375, we can now go to our next area, which is the underwater city. So we're gonna start here and end with the Fishman Warriors. You need to defeat 8, right? So lure 4 at the time. 1, 2, 3, and 4. There you go. Defeat them. Do it twice to level up. Guys, we're gonna level up here until we reach level 450. And to help us level up, we're gonna defeat the Fishman Lord. So we can start defeating him at 425. Guys, just after using your skills, just dodge. You need to dodge this skill of him, and that's it, guys. Like the Magma Admiral, once you dodge that skill, everything will be a lot easier. Again, the goal level here is 450. Oh, the Trident. Looks cool. Let me show it to you now. 
Moving on to our next island, but before that, stat check, 365 melee defense, 620 blocks fruit. Okay, so now, going back to the Skylands. Now we're gonna train in the upper yard. There you go. We're gonna start here with the God's Guards. So you can defeat six at a time. But if you want, you can lure four and another two, wait for them to spawn. It really depends to you, okay? As long as you defeat seven, you're gonna finish one quest. And for me, guys, I want to reach level 525 here. Yes, 525. But when you reach 500, you can start defeating the Whisper. Yes, Whisper, 500. But guys, even though you don't defeat him, it's fine, actually. <laughs> Just focus on leveling up. Tip in defeating Whisper. Just dodge his cannon. There you go, that, that cannon. So after every skill... Is your dodge and everything will be fine. Again, we're gonna skip the Shandas. We're gonna go straight to the Royal Squad. So you are required to defeat 8. So lure 3. There you go. Defeat them. Lure 2. Defeat them. And then lure 3. For one quest. Okay? Goal level here is to reach level 575. Yes, 575. And with that, you can start defeating the mini boss in this island to level up faster the Thunder God. So just like the other bosses, as long as you dodge a vicious skill, everything will be easy, okay? So again, the goal here is to reach level 625. Yes, I skipped the Royal Soldiers. Why? Because uh, they kind of have that a long range attack, which makes it hard for us to dodge. So I suggest that you focus on grinding on the Royal Squads and Thunder God. So stat check, 550 mil defense, 775 blast fruit off to our final grinding island which is the fountain city so we're gonna start and end here with the galley pirates you need to defeat eight right lure four at a time one two three and four defeat them guys tip here don't stay in one area for too long because they might hit you with their long range attack just like this see that i got hit so there you go guys lure four defeat them do it twice to finish one quest the goal here is to reach 700, yes, we're gonna skip the galley captains, but guys, when you reach level 675, you can start defeating Cyborg to make things faster. Oh, and by the way, at 300 Master, you've already unlocked the torture, so here it is. Aside from blinding the enemy when you hit him, there is a damage over time. See that? There's still damage, which is really, really cool. Guys, tip, just dodge that skill because that might burst you. <laughs> Okay, use your skills, dodge to the side, okay, as long as you dodge that, everything will be easy. In short, use your skill, dodge, use your skill wisely guys, because if you don't hit your enemy for a specific duration of time, his HP will return. So try to cycle your skills, so there you go. Once you reach level 700, a quest will emerge, but before that, start check, 550 mil defense, 1000 dust fruit. So for the quest, you need to go to the prison. Here we are. You need to talk to the detective. And then he will give you a key. So let's talk to him. There you go. Talk. Okay, now the key. Okay. So after receiving the key, you need to go to the frozen village. Okay, so here is the key. Okay, time to head to the frozen village. You guys remember the cave of the ability teacher? There you go. You're going to use the key to open the door. And inside here is the Ice Admiral, so you're gonna need to defeat him. There you go. Let's fast forward this. Is it easy? Exactly. Very easy. So go back to the detective in the prison. And after that, you can now go to the middle town. Yes, and talk to the experienced pirate. There's the experienced pirate. He's on the other side. There you go. And by talking to him, he will then send you to the second sea. So I think that's it for this video. Gamernom, was it hard? Guys, it really depends. It's subjective. If you really love grinding, then this will be easy and also enjoyable. For me, it's enjoyable. And again, guys, I'm doing this not just for me, but for all the viewers, subscribers, supporters. Guys, I appreciate you all. Again, this is Gamernom. See you in my next video. Rumblefruit and Gamernom out.